that was yesterday's spear fishing session that you just watched and um, I got the one fish and it's gonna be absolutely delicious so it's called a black spot tusk fish if I haven't mentioned it already um, the reason is because they've got this black spot here um, another name for them is a blue bone because they actually have blue bones and I'll, I'll show you that a bit later on while I'm eating the fish so what I've done is I've gutted the fish already I did that yesterday um, I actually have to still take the gills out and I've also scaled the fish so it's pretty much ready to go and I'm gonna put that on the barbecue and I'm gonna mix all these ingredients together here and then rub that into the fish so that's the plan there and I'm also gonna cook up these vegetables let's get cooking All right, there's our chips and asparagus all ready to rock and roll. Let's make sure I get all that slime off. And that's all you need to do. So, what I've now done is I've mixed salt, pepper, parsley, paprika, Mexican chili spice blend, garlic powder, and Cajun spice blend. I've just mixed that into this little bowl here, and that's what I'm going to be putting on the fish. Alrighty, before I do that, what I'm going to do is I'm going to trim the fin. Oh, do I? Nah, let's not worry about it. So what I'm going to now do is I'm just going to put in a few cuts. One there. One there. And one there. Also going to do one down the middle. This is just going to help cook it through quicker on the barbecue. And also with these ingredients that I'm going to rub on the fish, it's going to get into the flesh and it's just going to make it a lot tastier. So I'll do that on both sides now. It also looks really cool when it's, when it's being cooked. like so. I might get the vegetables on now and then I'll marinate the fish. Alright, let's put a bit of oil on these vegetables and then we're going straight into the oven. Perfect. Should take about 30 to 40 minutes. Marinate this fish. A little bit of oil. Rub that everywhere. And then let's put a bit of this on. So we'll put half on one side and then half on the other side. Same again. Oh, lovely. Right, let's go a little bit. A little generous amount. That's just all flavour. Alright, ready to hit the barbecue. Right, so I've just put some oil on this grill here, on the, well, on the flat side. 
I'm just going to make sure that's really hot before I put the tusky on. I'm thinking about 10 minutes aside. I've never cooked on this. I've never cooked fish on this grill before, on this plate before, so I'm not exactly sure how long it'll take, but normally a fish this side will be about eight to 10 minutes. At right, the moment of truth, I'm gonna flip it over. It's been about 10 minutes. Without getting burnt. Oh, how good is that look? That couldn't be any better. Wow. Guys, have a look at it. Help cook it through a little bit. A little bit of oil there in the fatter part of the fish. Nailed it. Bit of mayonnaise. Bit of lemon. Veggies. Looking really good. Roll them on. Finish it off a little bit more salt and pepper. And there we go, guys. Morton Bay. Black spot tusk fish and vegetables. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed that little cook up, guys. Now for the taste test. I'm sure it's going to taste absolutely phenomenal. Yeah, that looks so good. Oh, I got a fair bit of skin, but let's give it a crack. <laughs> a little bit. One of my favorite fish to eat. And cook this way. You don't waste any fish. Tastes so good. Look who else is here. Hey, you want some fish? Yeah, you do. Go on. Is it good? Oh, one more thing guys, you know how I was saying they're called blue bone? That's why they've actually got blue bones. It's pretty damn cool, hey. Put some more fish, bunny. Come on. Mm -hmm. Yummy? Very yummy. <laughs> See you guys.